is the Gaumont British News, presenting the world to the world. First event of a great sporting weekend drew vast crowds to every vantage point along the Putney to Morte Court. Dark and light blues were everybody's colours today, and as always, the support came from every age group. Oxford winning the toss chose the Middlesex Bank, and to the sound of one more preliminary cheer, both crews were soon moving up to the starting line. Anticipation nearly chokes some people as the crews get set and they're away. Oxford, on the far side, go all out for a decisive early lead. They're ahead by half a length and still drawing away. Coming up to Hammersmith Bridge and Oxford, now with a commanding lead, are putting on a hotter pace yet. Yes, for the moment, it suddenly looks like an impending victory for the Dark Blue. But drama was just around the bend, and here it comes as Cambridge, with a tremendous effort, drew level. And from now on, they're neck and neck with Oxford right down the last vital stretch. <laughs> on they go, blade to blade, dead level to the last few strokes. But in what's practically a photo finish, Cambridge win by just a quarter of a length. A battle of sheer endurance had been brilliantly won by Cambridge in the closest finish since 1877. To both crews, we say, well rowed in what may well be called the race of a lifetime. Mm -hmm.